Good morning, everybody. This is Nate over at Bullion RV. Got another video for you today. I'm in the shop. But today we have a 2022 Grand Design Momentum 29G. So we're gonna take you around the outside, show you some features. We'll take a look on the inside. Let me know what you think. Let's get started. So beautiful front cap here, LED lights up front, power tongue jack. We got propane tanks here. We do have a battery box here. So we'll take a look here. This does have two slides. Moving on down. So this does have a generator on board, QG4000 EVAP, which crazy enough, this only has one hour or 1.1 hours on the generator. Inside here, this is where your battery disconnect is gonna be located, as well as our other hookups here as well. Outdoor shower right here. Great tank down below. So we'll get a good view. Spare tire here. This is an enclosed underbelly. Very well taken care of unit. There's our hot water heater here. Our furnace here. Again, just taking a look at everything here. So we're gonna have our plug in here. 30 amp service double axle and I'm going to take a step back here so we could take another look at that slide and going down manual jacks on this one all right going forward so coming on down so we have our full up, fill up for our generator there's those jacks there LED light up above so you can see when you are walking on your roof there, you do have your ladder. And like I mentioned, this is a toy hauler, so we'll take a look at that here with a nice awning to cover that if you are enjoying a nice relaxing night out on the deck here. Lots of room to work with. And coming around to the other side here, You'll see that we do have another large power awning there. I'm going to come around. Again, you can kind of see everything in the shop here, but hopefully that's not too much of a problem. LED light strip above that. There's that second slide. Speakers on the outside. So again, double doors here too. Moving forward, you do have GFCI outlets. You do have your cable attachment here. Storage to work with. Goes up pretty high too, so if you are storing something uh, height-wise, you do have a lot to work with. And you do have your uh, TPMS sensor here, and then your light right here. So just getting another, I'm gonna back up as far as I can here, just so we could take another look. Very well taken care of toy hauler. It's a 2022, but it looks like it's hardly been touched. So let's head on to the inside. Here's our grab handle here, right in front of us, fire extinguisher for safety. And again, you'll see how clean that this actually is. So I'm in the living room now. I just walked in, so you'll see couch here. But I'm gonna start my way from the garage and work my way back. So let's head into there first. See everything here and you do have a power drop down bed and then you do have your power for your couch this is also a sleeping area and one thing I wanted to mention here is the previous owner actually left a uh, Kurt weight distribution hitch so that does come with this toy hauler here so we got our vents up above apologize for the noise in the shop today so we do have our windows here And then turning around, you do have storage up above. You do have your TV backer location right in front of me with your appropriate hookups up above. 
So here are the controls for your ceiling, lights, rear awning, your bed lift, and your awning, or your, sec or your awning again, my apologies. Another fire extinguisher here. Here's one of the doors. And then you do have a smaller bathroom back here. So smaller bathroom, space to work with though. And then you do have a towel rack. There's your mirror there with my beautiful face. And we do have our vent here as well. So it's just nice to have a bathroom back here. Now that I'm coming through, so now we're looking at, um, you know, living area, uh, entertainment area, kitchen area here. You do have your sofa that does recline. Grand design information bag here. Lots of storage to work with there. Storage to work with on the inside here. Deeper storage pockets. More GFCI outlets here. So looking at the counter space for the kitchen, lots to work with. We do have our three burner cooktop with our oven there as well, but lots of storage in this as well for your dishes, for your plates, whatever it's gonna be. up and then you do have your microwave right at eye level enhanced sound system as well but again very very well taken care of toy hauler so we'll get a look at the freezer and our fridge again this just looks brand new and then we'll have our entertainment area here. Fan up above, AC above me. So here's all of our controls and a little bit, little bit of storage. Command center for a generator. And like I mentioned in the very beginning of the video, it won't focus, but I hope you could see it. 1.1 hours on this generator. This toy hauler has hardly been touched. It's been really good shape. Very well taken care of. There's our TV, radio controls, smart remote. Little bit of storage down below to work with. All right, so moving on around. So we're gonna have our other bathroom here. So we have a bath and a half. Towel holder here. There's that latch to release to close the door. There's our vent there. There's our shower and sink. So I'm gonna walk around, get another view of the bathroom. Lots of storage. storage down below even the shower is clean lots of room to work with so again I'm 6'1 so I have I just have a massive amount of room to work with up here so you'll definitely be able to fit in the shower no problem coming into the bedroom so we'll have our bedroom here so again doors that close too so you do have your privacy up above here you're gonna have your cable satellite GFCI outlets and then you will have your TV backer location here as well. View from the bedroom into the living area there. Exit window here. A lot of natural light can come through here as well. And you do have storage up above the bed. Stats on this unit are gonna pop up in this general area here at the beginning of the video. So feel free to pause, get a little bit more knowledge. So I really like this mirror setup here too. This is something I haven't seen before, but a uh, bigger mirror, really nice. You do have storage down below that mirror. So you got your lights, GFCI outlets, lots of space here to work with. GFCI outlets and charging devices. 
or charging ports for your devices. Storage down below. More storage to work with. Storage to work with here. And a larger storage pocket in here for hanging clothes, anything that you want to put up there, you can kind of see where we hang our clothes. But I'll do one final walkthrough here. Again, this is just very well taken care of. And here's our bath, and a, or here's our actual bathroom. Moving on through. Here's our kitchen area, here's our fridge. So we'll get a view of everything in the living room. Kitchen area here. Entertainment. And there's the other door for the bathroom. Lots of natural light can come through this unit here as well. Big windows. And then going back out into the garage. And then your half bath here. Very nice unit. That's gonna do it for this video. Again, my name's Nate Green from Bullion RV. Happy to get this video out for you guys. Just a very, very well taken care of 2022 uh, toy hauler here. Again, all the information is gonna pop up on the screen. My information will be in the or the box down below. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, help Bullion get to 20,000 subscribers. If you wanna set up an appointment with me, again, like I said, all my information is down below. Give me a call, 218-740-4965. Again, smash that like button, subscribe. We'll catch you in the next one.